Alright guys, welcome back to another video here on the channel, and this is a LEGO Star Wars The Skywalker Saga video for you guys. Now, I hope you guys are enjoying these videos, I'm still trying to catch up a little bit with uh, everything that's going on in my life at the moment, as well as, you know, uh, you know, trying to catch up, up from uh, all the news that we've had recently, recently from LEGO Star Wars The Skywalker Saga. Now, of course, we know that it's been delayed until, you know, uh, spring of 2021, which is, of course, fall or autumn for us in the southern hemisphere so we have to wait about another five or six months until this game comes out which is very unfortunate because i know a lot of you guys and myself included were looking forward for this game to be coming out very well obviously it was hot we were hoping that was gonna be next month october 20th but unfortunately it has been delayed until 2021 but in this video guys i'm going to be going over some of the deluxe edition stuff that we can get that we can expect uh from the deluxe edition version of lego star wars the skull saga as well as some character packs of different themes as well and you know possible some new dlc after that as well so let's get straight into the video if you guys enjoy this type of content and would like to see more of this in the future do let me know by you know commenting down below and uh yeah let me know what you guys are most looking forward to in lego styles the skywalker saga but now let's get straight into the video now, if you guys have been keeping up to date with some of the pre-orders from different, uh, you know, websites and, you know, game stores, we have seen the cover art for the deluxe edition for LEGO Star Wars The Skywalker Saga. Now, it does include this case, which looks very cool. Um, you know, it's got, you know, Vader unmasked, but it also comes with a slip cover, where if you put it on, you actually put the helmet onto Darth Vader, which I think is pretty cool. It's a nice little touch, uh, you know, that little bit of extra detail, which, you know, I think a lot of people will be happy about. I know, uh, I don't know if I'll be in the deluxe edition myself. You can only get this edition if you pre-order like the physical co physical copy i usually go my games digital now so i'm not sure i'll probably get getting this but uh let me know if you guys are in, would be getting this one um i think yeah it's it's pretty cool nonetheless now unfortunately not everywhere has uh, you know got the deluxe edition order for pre-sale yet uh you know it just says coming soon and there's no really other additional description but on f a few websites actually that we have discovered of what is actually going to be entailed with the deluxe edition of course we have this or you know awesome cover this awesome sleeve that we're going to be getting there's a few other things as well but the most things that we're mostly interested about this guys and what i'm making this video about is the character packs that are coming into lego star wars the skywalker saga now of course we know there are some dlc already confirmed for lego star wars the skywalker saga of course we have the lego sets the six lego sets that have come out we have the razor crest and we have all the other characters you know and ships that are available when you get the code when you buy those lego sets and now those are those are universal codes they have already you know been put out online they're everywhere so once the game drops you can put that into you know into your into your code section wherever you might put that on your playstation xbox or pc or even on nintendo switch as well which is going to be on nintendo switch is, which is going to be awesome so you can unlock these certain characters and ships as well but also like i said have these character packs that are going to be coming uh with the deluxe edition un unless you want to buy them separately if you don't get the deluxe edition but these six character packs are we have one from mandalorian season one which I would be guessing is like, you know, all the characters that we see that come along with the Razor Crest. So we're obviously going to get Mandalorian. We'll get, uh, you know, Baby Yoda as well. Or the child, as we should say. Um, which I think is going to be interesting to see how, we, how you know, Baby Yoda is going to work in a LEGO game. I think that's going to be a lot of fun. There'll obviously, be, I think, be a lot of other characters from the Mandalorian. Like, you know, all the main characters that you see from Season 1. There's also going to be one from Mandalorian Season 2. And now that, of course, we know there's going to be a lot of rumoured characters coming into Mandalorian Season 2. Of course, two of which are Sabine and Ahsoka, um, as well as Rex, possibly as well. So, you know, there's there's a lot of, uh, you know, potential there for, you know, characters that aren't in the Skywalker Saga itself. They're in the TV shows and all that. But they could be coming into, you know, the game in another way, in another form. We also have packs for Rogue One, A Star Wars Story, and Solo, A Star Wars Story. So, you know, you might have get different skins for, you know, Han, Lando, you know, you get all, you know, obviously get, get Jin, Cassian from these stories. But I was hoping that we actually would get to see some levels. But of course, you know, this is the Skywalker Saga, it is based on the nine films. But it is nice to see, you know, different characters coming from, you know, all, you know, from all over Star Wars, I think. Uh, you know, it doesn't mean that there won't be, you know, further DLC down the road, uh, you know, with, you know, level packs possibly, uh, but we'll just have to wait and see about that one. We also have one from The Bad Batch. This is number five. The Bad Batch, of course, is a TV show coming out. I think it's in 2021, um, of course, which is based around, you know, Bad Batch from season seven. Also remember that there will be Ahsoka and Rex in there as well. Um, so we don't know. Yeah, this could be another way to get Ahsoka and Rex in the game. I know, you know, Ahsoka and Rex are a fan favorite, so I wouldn't be put past Lego 
you know, all TT, TT games to put them in the game somehow. Now, the one that I'm not too sure about what could be added in it is the classic characters pack. Now, this is, of course, you know, we're going to see a lot of the characters from the prequels from, you know, there's going to be over five, over 500 characters, most of them playable. Now, this could be this could i don't know what this could entail the classic characters pack let me know what you guys think in the comment section below because i'm really stumped on this one but those are all the dlc packs that we have uh you know been announced so far guys like i said i'm hoping that there's some level packs you know that will get announced you know maybe further down the line that could also be added i think that could be a lot of fun um but of course this is the biggest lego star wars game that's ever been made almost the biggest star wars game that's ever been made and you know it's gonna be open world it's you know it's just gonna be a lot of fun and i can't wait to play this with you guys um you know stream it you know make some more awesome videos with it let me know what you guys would like to see in the comment section below i would really like to let uh, you know to get give you give you guys a shot of uh you know what content you would like to see on the channel but thank you guys so very much for watching i'm gonna get out of here thank you guys so very much for watching i'll see you guys in the next video or stream and as always may the force with you all always